Okay guys, I think I finally set up my ring light. It's like resting on my like a towel right now and it was really stressful, but we're gonna get on with that. So my skin's all prepped. I've moisturized and all of that kind of stuff. I've got a shoot today, so I thought I would film it for you. I'm already dressed in what I'm gonna wear just to get into the mood. And I um, hope you guys enjoy. I'm just gonna do this makeup look. I don't know where I'm gonna put it, maybe here. It was highly requested, one of my most recent posts. So I'm just gonna recreate it for you guys. It's pretty similar to my usual makeup look. I'll list everything down below for you guys so it's just easier that way. If you guys watched my recent YouTube video, you'd know that I'm mixing my concealer and my CC cream together to get my base. So I'm just gonna dot that all over. Don't freak out if it's a little bit dark for my face. It matches my body in the end. Oops. I was at the beach today and I feel like I hit a bit of a wall. I'm feeling a little bit tired. I'm gonna try and get this done as soon as I can so I can go to sleep. I hope the weather holds up today because I've planned this content day all week and it's going to be raining all this week and now i'm scared i'm not going to be able to get photos that i want but i'm manifesting good weather it's going to hold up for me just starting some concealer while that rests on my face i'm just going to pop on my cream contour do you guys ever look at old photos of yourself and think oh my god i used to do my makeup so different i was doing that the other day and i was like wow why did i stop doing that and that like a particular eye look or whatever i've recently been blending out my products with a brush instead of a beauty blender Does anyone else put like all of their effort into their makeup and then just throw their hair up? I feel like that's what I do all the time. I'm not really like a hair girl. I just like work with whatever my hair is doing that day. I'm gonna start actually doing stuff with my hair. A little like baby hair. I don't know what it's called. The side pieces. Also, when I try this product that got sent to me was it's the Ciate London Dewy Stick and it looks like that. Smells so good. <laughs> mm, that is really pretty. I'm also gonna grab some of my bronzer and pop that as I would an eyeshadow and just drag it out. I feel like laying down a liquid under all of your powders really helps to like look more vibrant and I feel like it lasts longer as well. I'm also just grabbing more of a full coverage concealer and I'm just cleaning up and adding a bit more coverage. So now I just erased that and we're about to set. I'm just going in with my other Laura Mercier powder because my usual shade is running out. I'm also going to try out this bronzer. It's the Ciate London Bamboo Bronzer in Palm Island. Pretty shade. I actually quite like that. I feel like it's kind of airbrushed my skin to be honest. I actually added a bit of coverage which I like. I can use that as like a base beneath my normal bronzer now. Going in with my usual Too Faced bronzer just to sculpt out the cheeks a little bit more. I don't really like my wings too thick or bold just for my eye shape. And they don't have to be too even because I'm going to smoke it out a bit. Love. Grabbing a white shade from the palette. Cleaning it up a bit. Taking my bronzer and I'm going to set that cream contour that we put in the lid and also blend out that white that we just put on the inner corner. So I've just grabbed a dark shade from that palette 
and I'm gonna smoke out this wing. I'm just gonna brush up my eyebrows. Just filling in the spare spot right here and right here. I'm actually using a serum someone sent to me. It was an eyebrow and an eyelash serum and I'm gonna see if I actually see any results because I'm just popping it right where I have the spare spots. We're just baking the smallest bit. Isn't that the most annoying thing when you break a highlighter and then you have to like hold it all weird? Going in and contouring a little bit more. I'm just doing that little inner corner liner. Just like that. I'm also highlighting my inner corners. I usually do put on cream blush beneath powder blush, but I don't want it to be as intense today, so I'm just putting on the powder on its own. These lashes are on their last legs. You know when you take the glue off and then it takes a little piece from the end? That's where we're at. <laughs> I'm going to give our lashes a bit of a curl. So mascara is on, I'm just going to line my lips. I am just using the Ciate London Pump Plump, it's just a lip plumping gloss. It does feel a little bit tingly, not heaps, but I haven't tried a lot of lip plumping glosses anyway. That's really nice. Okay, so it does look a little bit shorter, but we're gonna ignore it. <laughs> I'm also just popping some shadow on the very outer corner of my eye, just like that. This is the finished look. It was what I was wearing in that post. I hope you guys like it. And I can't wait to keep making videos for you guys. So comment down in the comment section what you think of this video and if you wanna see anything else from me. Also, can you guys let me know if you like the background or should I like move it into my bedroom or something? I don't know, this just seems to be working for the moment, but let me know what you guys think because I obviously value your opinions very much so.